battle is set in September 1813, after the summer armistice, but before the Battle of Leipzig. Napoleon's plan was to take Berlin and knock Prussia out of the war. Ney had uh, just taken over after Oudinot had been repulsed at the Battle of Grossbeeren, and Ney had the same orders to take Berlin. So he's driving up with his army all the way up the road to Berlin, and the Prussians are trying to stop them. So here you can see the map that we'll be playing on. Uh, north is to the left of the screen and south to the right. So Berlin is off to the northeast. The French reinforcements will be arriving from the right and the Prussian reinforcements from the bottom left. It's an eight foot by five foot map uh, for the tabletop. So lots and lots of space for this size of units. Uh, the situation is that uh, Tautzen, which is number one, uh, Tautzen's corps has been falling back and uh, against superior French numbers and they've just learned that they will be in reinforced by Bullo, so they are making a stand. You'll see the uh, village of Denowitz in the center of top of the map with a stream running through uh, to the village of Niedergoesdorf. Up in the top left you'll see two woods. Those two crossroads uh, represent the uh, road to Berlin and they uh, are part of the French victory condition. So if neither army breaks, if the French hold those two crossroads at the end of the game, then they win. The Prussians have very tough victory conditions. They have to push the French back over the entire northeast sector, back behind the river. Initially, only one core, the weakest core uh, of the Prussians, is on the map in position one. That is Tauentzin's core. However, the Prussians are arriving very soon in positions two, four, and three on the bottom left of the map. The French set up uh, with Bertrand's corps initially on the map in positions 1, 2, 3 and 4 and their reserves are coming on the south end of the map, that is the right hand side. You have Rainier's corps coming on first and then about halfway through Oudinot's corps arrives. The Prussian OOB has 22 units, so they have a breakpoint of 8 losses. Uh, they have a vigorous commander below, which means the activation cost of their first corps move is halved. Uh, Townsend is the corps on the map at the moment, which seems fairly weak with uh, 4 uh, conscript landwehr units. Below is a lot stronger, he's got 5 of the very strong mixed skirmish attached artillery units uh, uh, and uh, supported by grenadiers and strong artillery, especially the Russian heavy artillery. The French have three corps. Bertrand's corps is on the map at the start. A standard French infantry, six with skirmish bonus, with some light cavalry attached. Uh, Rainier's corps is strong as well, six skirmish attached artillery units. Uh, the French cavalry at this stage is pretty weak, even the heavy cavalry is only six, and the light cavalry a strength of five. Oudinot's corps arrives halfway through and is uh, as strong as the Saxon corps of Radio. In total, the French have 30 units, giving them 